can you, Adam and Eve it, we have made it to 10 Ciroc line dances. So happy decade of learning line dance with me. I hope you've enjoyed it along the way. And we've got a real exciting one for you now. It's to Jason Mraz, I feel like dancing. And the routine looks like this. And it looks like this I like to dance and it looks like this uh, I like to pop and lock And hit you with a little bit of robot Got to hit it, get it, love it, live it Get a little silly with the lyrical ridiculousness I like to shake a leg I like to nod my head I like to walk into a party with a pirouette A little move goes a long way Like a soul train line in a hallway It's your Looks fun, right? So this is a line dance over four bars of eight counts. We're going to teach you each individual bar on its own. Then we'll look at the timing and then we'll progress on to looking at the four different walls. So turn and face me. I'm going to turn my back to you. The first bar of eight is actually the hardest. So we're going to get the tricky bit done first of all. The right foot takes a step forwards. The left foot takes a step forwards. After that second step, you're going to cross the right foot in front of your left foot, crossing the legs over and placing the weight down onto your right toe. At that point, slide the left foot behind. So a big step back with the left foot, transferring the weight over that foot as you turn 180 degrees to the left to face the opposite direction. Now you're gonna do that same movement again. Keep the left foot where it is, step the right foot forwards and pivot again 180 degrees to the left in an anti-clockwise direction to face the same way that you started. From here, transfer the weight forwards, bringing the feet side by side and we add a little cross step where you hop the feet and cross them over and then hop the feet back to where they started. So, it is the hardest bar. Let's do it again together. The right foot steps forward. The left foot steps forward. Cross the right foot in front of the left, placing the weight on the toe, and take a big step backwards with the left foot. Now, transfer the weight on that foot and turn to the left as you step forwards with the right, and then turn to the left as you bring the feet to parallel. Here's the little hop. We cross over and cross back. So let's just try that one bar again, a little bit quicker. Right foot walks forwards, left foot walks forwards. Cross the legs over, step back with the left, pivot, step forwards with the right, pivot, bring the feet side by side, and we cross and open. So that's the tricky bar number one. You'll be very pleased to hear that bar number two, following that, is the easiest. All you're gonna do is grapevine to the left and grapevine to the right. So you step side, behind, side, bring the feet together, and in the opposite direction, side, behind, side, and bring the feet together. And that's half of the dance completed already. So let's go back to the top and try both of those bars without stopping. Walk forwards, right foot, Left foot, cross the legs over, take a big step back and pivot. Step with the right foot and pivot. Bring the feet side by side and cross and open. You're now gonna move across to the left. So try and get your weight onto your right foot to pick up the left foot, side, behind, side, together. Opposite direction, side, behind, side, and together. Now. On to bar number three. You're going to pivot your body diagonally left to face this corner and dig your right heel into the floor. But don't put any weight 
on that foot. Your weight is still on your left foot. It's just a dig of the heel and then return the feet back to parallel to face forward once again. Let's do it in the opposite direction. So pivot uh, to face the diagonal on your right hand side. You dig the left heel into the floor, but again, no weight on it as you pivot back to face the front. A little bit quicker, you dig heel, front, dig heel and front. For the next part of this bar, angle your body again to that first diagonal on your left hand side, walking with the right foot and walking with the left foot. Now, you're going to do a hitch with the right knee now, which is where you lift the right knee up in the air and essentially you hop with your left foot. But the difference between a hop and a hitch is that foot doesn't actually leave the floor. It just, if I turn this way to show you, it scoots along the floor. A very, very tiny movement, keeping that toe in contact. So again, coming back to the digging of the heels, you dig right, feet together, dig left, feet together, two walks for one and for two, keep the left toe on the floor as you hitch the knee up, scooch, and then place that right foot down in front of you. So again, just bar three on its own so we can practice this together. Heel dig one, feet to parallel. Heel dig with the left, feet to parallel. On the diagonal, walk right foot, walk left foot, hitch, and walk right foot. And those are the first three bars. So let's take it back to the top and walk it from the beginning. Walk right foot, left foot, cross, step back and pivot. Right foot, pivot, feet side by side, hop, hop. Then we're gonna grapevine, left and grapevine, right. Turning to the diagonal, dig the right heel, face the left heel face go for a walk right foot left foot hitch and place the right foot down on the floor so we finish this section facing the diagonal on your left hand side i'm going to move back a little bit so i've got some space and you've just placed the weight down onto your right foot the final bar of eight you rock the weight forwards onto the left foot and then back onto the right foot we're going to shuffle step backwards. So first of all, take the left foot back, then cross the right foot in, locking it in front of the left foot, and take the left foot back one more time. So let's return to that position. You've just taken a step with your right foot. You're going to rock forwards on the left, keep the feet where they are, back on the right, and then step back with the left, shuh, full, step. So you're now back left foot behind right. The final part of the fourth bar is very, very simple. You're going to complete a slide, but over four beats. But it's very important that you slide in the correct direction. And in order to do this, I want you to look over the top of your right shoulder to the wall that's behind you. That's the way that you're going to slide, taking a big step out with the right foot, slide to face the new wall against which we're going to start the next round of the line dance. So let's just jump back to that final bar. You've just stepped with the right foot. You're going to rock forwards and back. Here's the shuffle step. Back together, back. And look over your right shoulder and slide for one, two, three, four beats, bringing the feet together, ready to start again. So with that bar four in place, let's now link everything together from the very top. So facing the front, we're starting with the right foot. Walk forwards with the right, the left. Cross over, step back, pivot, step, pivot, feet together, and then cross open, nice and quick. Grapevine to the left, and then grapevine to the right. This is the heel digging section. You dig the right heel, together. You dig the left heel and together. On the diagonal, here's the hitch. You walk one, two, hitch and place the right foot down on the floor. Now we have the rock step. Forwards with the left, back on the right, sh, full, step, look over your right shoulder, slide, two, three, four. And that's the dance complete. Let's now look at the timing. 
So with the timing, we are looking for four bars of eight. However, look out for those pesky half beats where we're dancing at double speed to the track. So we're going to start facing this direction, walking forwards with the right foot. Count with me four sections of eight beats. Walking with the right foot, one, left, two, cross, three, back, four, pivot, five, pivot, six, feet together, seven, and eight. That's double speed. We walk to the left. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Get the weight onto your left foot. One, two, three, four, walk, five, six, hit, seven, step eight, rock one, back two, shuffle three and four, and really take your time here, slide five, six, seven, finish on eight, ready to start in a new direction. So up to speed before we go to our four walls. Here we go, five, six, seven, eight, Walk, one, two, cross, three, back, four, pivot, five, six, seven, and eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Heels, one, two, heels, three, four, walk, five, six, hitch, seven, down, eight, rock, one, two, shuffle, three, and four, slide, five, six, seven, eight. Now here is the bit that turns everybody's brain into porridge, because this is when we do the dance, but facing four different directions. Now when you start facing different walls, the main thing that challenges people is any moments where there's a pivot or a change of direction. Now thankfully, in this dance, there's not many of those instances. All there is at the start is a pivot round to face the opposite wall, but then you immediately pivot back to face the same direction that you started. So that's quite a simple moment. All of this is facing the same wall, we have the little twists, but again, you can keep your head facing the same direction. Our walks are to the diagonal, but again, facing the same direction. Now, this is the challenging bit here. When you go into the shuffle step backwards, everyone panics, first of all, about which direction to turn and which wall they're going to end up facing. So all I want you to remember is as you're doing your shuffle step backwards, first things first, look behind your right shoulder and you will end up facing the direction which you need to end up looking at in order to go into our next wall. So let's try all four walls together. Good luck, this is the hard bit. Walking forwards with the right foot. One, two, cross, three, back, four, pivot, five, six, seven, hop, eight, grapevine, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, weight on the left foot on eight, heels, one, two, three, four, walk, five, six, hitch, seven, eight, rock step, one, two, three, and four, here we go, look over the right shoulder, turn to the right, find your new wall, five, six, seven, eight, okay, so we're now facing this way, I'm just going to shuffle myself back a little bit so I stay on camera, walking with the right foot first, walk right, left, cross over, step back, pivot to face the opposite direction, pivot to face the original direction, feet go side to side, hop, hop. Now you're grapevining to the left, keep facing the same way. Grapevine, 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 grapevine. Weight on the left foot. Heel, turn to the left diagonal. Heel together, heel together. Walk to the left diagonal. Right, right, hitch, place it down. Rock, step, shuffle, step. Now if I look back and over my right shoulder now, I will end up facing you, which means we're now turning to face the back wall. Here we go. Slide six, seven, eight. Now, you can't see me, ha ha ha, but I can see you through your TV screens. Walking with your right foot, you have one, two, cross, three, step back, four. Turn to look at me, step five, six, turn to look away from me, seven, hop, eight. Grapevine to the left, one, two, three, four, to the right, five, six, seven, eight. Eight. Turn to face your left diagonal. 
heel one, together two, heel three, together four. Walk to the left diagonal, right, left, hitch, place it down. Stepping forwards with the left foot, rock, step backwards, shuffle, step, look over your right shoulder and hopefully you'll locate the final wall that we haven't danced to yet, slide six, seven, eight. Right, good luck, you're on your own. One, two, cross, three, back, four, pivot, five, six, feet together, seven, hop, eight, grapevine, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, left diagonal, one, two, three, four, walk, five, six, hitch, seven, down, eight, rock, step forwards and back, shuffle, step, and if you've completed four walls, by looking over your right shoulder, you should find your original wall, five, six, seven, eight, and at that point, you are complete. Well done. You've danced our line dance, our Ciroc line dance for 2024, number 10. You've done it facing all four walls. Let's crack that music back on and give it a go together. I like to dance and it looks like this. I like to dance and it looks like this. I like to pop and lock and hit you with a little bit of robot. Gotta hit it, get it, love it, live it, get a little silly with the lyrical ridiculousness. I like to shake a leg. I like to nod my head. I like to walk into a party with a pirouette. A little move goes a long way, like a soul train line in a hallway. It's your way, my 